plastic waste is basically drowning our planet. We have achieved over a thousand pounds of diverted plastic in only a year. Keen students have embraced the challenge to easily achieve that amount. And then they see how much more is out there. Unrecycled plastic, especially of the film type, is going to haunt us. Because it doesn't easily break down into less complicated parts, it'll last thousands of years. Microplastics is going to be a very large anthropogenic human problem. The Trex Recycling Program helps to put a dent in that and will also keep Kane's campus a lot cleaner. Learning that plastics do not decompose, that they're going into our waste systems, our water systems. Kane students are becoming more mindful of sustainability. What I learned from participating in this challenge is that we waste a lot of plastic. As I was accumulating it, I would start saying, I can literally rinse this bag out and reuse it because it's still useful. They're realizing that something as small as that Ziploc bag amongst millions of people adds up. Every pound we divert is an impactful statement. And when they see that this plastic is not going to sit around for 10,000 years, they really get ramped up. As soon as I heard about it, I was completely 100% on board. By taking that active role, they feel a little bit more empowered. I tell my students we're in a voting season. We have to consider who's going to help us actually build the sustainable model. These small steps can lead to these bigger initiatives. Are we going to change the world? Maybe not, but we're changing Kane's part of the world. And that's really where this homegrown endeavor will tentacle out into their own lives. When I have students later, I can say to them, hey, do you want to try something fun throughout the year? Let's see how much plastic we can save. This project not only is helpful for me now, but for my students in the future.